Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another video. So, today, as you can see by the title of this video, we are getting everything done today. We're cleaning, we're going grocery shopping, I'm doing all the things, and today's the day to get it done. It is Saturday, and these are usually my most productive days when it comes to housekeeping. So, also, fun fact, I am home by myself. G is at work. And the kids are visiting my mom. She came and she picked them up because she wanted to take them. So I let her. And I kind of am feeling the whole vibe of me just kind of being home by myself and having a few hours for me so that I can clean up my home in peace and maybe play some music. I don't know. There's something very therapeutic about being alone and being able to tackle the chores. You know, I'm kind of just in my zone. I'm on autopilot, just kind of like replaying things in my mind, making a plan for myself in my head, going over the things I need to do, and just silently being by myself in my own mind without any interruptions while still being productive. I love it. So. That's what we're gonna do today. We are going to clean up the house first. That is the first thing on my list. I need a clean space because let me show you the hot mess that is now my home. Utter disrespect. I fully acknowledge this. We literally, I've, I, ugh, ugh. I have dinner sitting out from last night. Who am I anymore? Who am I? And I have the crock pot, filthy, just open girl, just left it open. The dishwasher, those are clean, but they've been open since, I think, yesterday morning. I don't even remember. I'm afraid to look inside the sink. Yep. Yep. Oh, God. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Also, food and snacks everywhere. I'm pretty sure this is... Yep, that should have been in the trash. How about you? Yep. How about this? Halfway full. Okay. Not only are we messy, but we're wasteful. Okay. Um, G came home yesterday from work and brought a whole bag of treats and sweets and he was like, you've been stressed, I brought you candy. <laughs> I was like, thank you, but I don't, I don't need this. I don't need this right now. Also, just a ray of shoes. Those don't even fit Naughty anymore. I need to do something with that. Oh, and look at this. There's a dryer just open. It's just open. That's just what happens. That's fine. We're gonna turn around. I'm gonna take you to my room. Please do not be shocked. I want you to anticipate the horror of my space. Ready? Here we go. No, 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 no. It's a mess in here too. I know. So we have stuff all over the place. I don't even like water bottles. Is this empty? Like G does this thing where he loves the water, but he likes to just put it on the floor. <laughs> Sometimes it's empty, sometimes it's not. I don't know. At least my plant is beautiful and going strong. I gave her a bath for like 24 hours. She's soaked in water and she's just thriving. At least one of us is doing good here, girl. One of us. Yeah, so the bed needs to get made. Dirty clothes. Pretty sure that's a bra that's filthy. I need to wash that. And just a lot of things. Just a lot of things happening in here. Bathroom is not as bad as I had thought it might be. Um... Just stuff. Ooh, need to empty out that brush. Does anybody like you brush your hair and just like there's hair in the brush? Don't look at it. Um, clean the bathroom. Honestly, usually I don't clean the bathroom. G tackles this, but I'm gonna try to do it today. Um, you know, since we're cleaning, might as well kind of try to get in here as well. I'm gonna take you into Nathan's room first because it's never usually that bad. His room's never that bad. Probably just gonna wash his sheets. Um, get some fresh light in here yeah so Nathan's room never really that bad he's, he's all, always the kid that I can count on you know to do the right thing <laughs> and be clean and just just the best son you know mom could ask for and now let's go to Nadia's room <laughs> um you know honestly I feel like her room isn't that bad it's just a lot of stuff <sighs> there you go I mean she has so many plushies, and this isn't even all her plushies. There's more. I don't know where they're hiding. I'm probably going to find them somewhere when I'm cleaning, but I really feel like I want to take this opportunity that she's not here to just get rid of all the stuff that she really doesn't need. So many toys. So many toys. Oh my gosh. Don't even get me started on this desk. This beautiful desk that I, you know, 
gave her <laughs> so she can have a space to draw and just read and do her homework and do all the things I didn't anticipate or foresee the added mess that it would cause to the space. I just, oh my God, I don't know. I don't know how many videos that I've posted where I'm like cleaning or I say I'm gonna clean up today and be productive and then I come to Nadia's room and I just, I look inside and then I close the door because it, it hurts. It hurts to look inside there. Okay, we're gonna start with laundry first. Uh, actually, let's do Nadia's laundry because for some reason she has more clothes than Nathan does, so. We'll start with Nadia's clothes first. All right, here we go. Hey, remember that time I said like Nadia has more plushies than this and I'll probably find some somewhere around the house? I found one. Should we just make a game? Like, how many plushies can we find throughout the house, right? I was shocked. I thought I unplugged it and God, it was on hot this whole time. gonna move on to a new portion of the house so like every so often maybe like once or twice a week I like to um, fluff up my couch 
and make it like more fluffy and get all the dust and all the things. So I'm going to do that right now. Without your love, I am out of place. And without you, I am just a trace. I love you. Ugh, that is so much better. Doesn't that look a lot more fluffy and inviting? Ugh, yes. But no, I can't sit down. I still got work to do. I'll be back for you. I'll be back. Listen. Whoa. Ow, 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 ow. Girl. Yeah. Put on some music. Dance and vibe and clean your house. That is what my heart says. That's what my heart says. I wanna be with you always, always. Yeah. You are my world in every place. Oh, oh, oh. It's the things I do, do. It's the things you do, baby. It's the smile on your face, smile on your face. And as time goes by. From the first time I saw ya You were not like the others A cool kind of melody You rattled my cage without warning Kept it up right till the morning A new kind of ecstasy You found a different side of me The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah Find a different side of me Like someone pretty need A different side of me, yeah So my house is clean floors are cleaned kitchen clean nadia's room as clean as it's gonna get <laughs> oh my gosh my main thing was like wiping down this dirty desk but it's so much better now kids bathroom is clean nice and clean in here everything looks so much better it smells so good nathan's room um i need to wash his sheets but his clothes are going in the washer right now but i vacuumed pretty much and dusted so everything else is fine in here it's not that bad in nathan's room the floors feel so good on my feet it's so clean my room is clean dusted this yeah wiped down my desk for work and dusted the whole thing everything is dusted and wiped down and the bathroom my bathroom is clean too looks so good so good honestly girl i swear cleaning the whole house was just exhausting when i was 26 or in my like mid 20s i would tackle the whole house and i think i would feel pretty good after like i still had energy to do other things like when i was younger <laughs> and you can actually literally go back and look at older videos of mine when i was like in my 20s and 
I cleaned the whole house. I had a three bedroom, two and a half bath townhome. And I would clean that whole house by myself in one day. Dust, Windex, clean all the bathrooms, clean the floors, just do a whole shebang of cleaning and laundry and be good. I think I would do it in like, I don't know, two, three hours. But girl, I've been cleaning since like 10 in the morning and it's two o'clock. <laughs> Mama's tired. I'm tired. Honestly, I think I'm gonna take a shower and just be vibing and maybe watch a show and fold the rest of the laundry <gasps> Ooh. But I do feel better that my house is so clean and it smells so good like I feel like I accomplished Everything that I meant to do for myself. I Just got out of the shower. <laughs> I was gonna fold the clothes like really quick and then shower but i was like oh my god a shower sounds so good right now like i'd rather do that i'm just letting my hair air dry and then i'll probably straighten it again but in the meantime now that i feel so much better and refreshed and i'm clean i'm gonna fold i'm gonna fold those clothes and put on a show Welcome back. Today is another day and I'm actually in the car right now. I'm at Target. You can't see, but I'm at Target right now and we're going to start doing like the groceries and everything that needs to get done for the day. Um, so first off, we're going to hit Target and then I'm going to grab a few things in here like essentials for the home, you know, paper towels, laundry stuff, maybe some dish soap. I'm not sure, but I brought my list here um it's not done or completed at all um i kind of woke up this morning and i intended to write my grocery list and all the things that i needed and that didn't work out <laughs> me and you were like let's just get up and go and do our things and so he's handling his business and running his errands and I have peace and quiet to myself I'm all alone I'm gonna do the groceries and go to Target and do all the things but I figured that you know I would take you guys with me obviously also I need to get my nail fixed so yesterday when I was cleaning my nails it cracked look can you see oh my god it's terrible <laughs> it hurts and like I need to get it fixed and I just got my nails done so I'm only gonna get this one nail fix so hopefully it's not gonna be expensive and then I'll probably get a pedicure also but anyways it's enough chatter let's get these errands started okay first stop are my candles I always have to get candles of course favorite scent that I have going in my house right now always have this Perfect for fall, smells so good. tell you what just happened I was getting all my stuff that I needed to get and <laughs> I couldn't reach um so like I got all my stuff and then I forgot one thing I was like dang like I need to get um laundry like fabric softener I was like shoot so I go I leave the line and then I go back all the way to the back of the store and I see my detergent is all the way in the back and I can't reach it and so I'm like dang like I'm so stuck and I didn't see like any like people that work there to like help me out and then I saw this girl and her boyfriend walk by and I was gonna ask them but I didn't and then I saw this like um, older man like I don't know maybe like late 40s and he was by himself and I was just like I'll ask this guy because I felt like better to ask I was like excuse me can I borrow you for a second and then he goes yeah a big smile on his face I was like okay and so he's smiling and he's just like yeah what's up how can I help you and I was like um 
can you please grab me the fabric softener? I can't reach it. I'm so short. Um, I need to borrow you for a minute. And so he goes, he goes, yeah, absolutely. And he grabs it and he hands it to me and I was like, thank you so much. Have a great day. And he's like, you have a great day as well. And I was like, okay, awesome. So I'm walking away and I just had this vibe and this feeling that, um, <laughs> <laughs> he was gonna like come and ask me for my number and sure enough I'm checking out he's in the lane next to me and I'm like oh my god this is so awkward like you know so I'm checking out and I'm like okay geez and I'm trying to like hustle and I grab my stuff and I'm like walking and like hustling out the store and he's there straggling behind me and then <laughs> he comes up to me and he goes hey excuse me um I should have asked you this back in the store, but maybe I can get your number. And I was like, oh, that's really sweet. Um, I'm married though. And he's like, oh, okay. Something with dudes and seeing a damsel in distress, they just automatically just want to be the hero. And they think that if they help you, that, oh, out of all the people she could have asked, she asked me. I'm like, no, sir. You were the only one that are you were the only one that was around that's why i needed to ask you i needed my fabric softener do you guys ever pull that like even if like a guy comes up to you and even if you're a single girl do you be like oh i'm married or i have a whole boyfriend i remember like when i was single and like dudes would like come up to me i would do that but sometimes that wouldn't even stop them girl they'd be like so do you need a friend <laughs> like and I okay so we're done with groceries I'm gonna pack these up in my trunk here and then we'll do a grocery haul when I get home. So before we go home, I'm gonna stop at Starbucks because I am craving a drink. And I've been doing this thing on my Instagram stories where on Saturdays, usually in the mornings, um, I go to Starbucks. So I've been posting like this Saturdays at Starbucks series where I try different drinks and have like different um, like concoctions and honestly, most of them are hits and you guys really like it so if you're not following me on instagram and you want to check out my saturdays at starbucks series make sure to do that all right so i just got my fall favorite my go-to fall drink from starbucks um it's a venti iced chai tea latte i have three pumps of chai three pumps of brown sugar and i did soy milk and i added extra pumpkin cold cream like cold foam on top it's so good it literally tastes like fall in a cup you have to try it. It's so bomb. Oh. Oh. These bags are heavy. Oh. Yeah. I'm finally home and I brought in all of the groceries. So I'm going to get into this grocery haul and show you guys everything that I got. So before I put my groceries away, I'm going to clean out my fridge. So I'm gonna use this Method all-purpose cleaner, spray it down and wipe it, and then I'll put the groceries away. Okay, so I emptied the first bag and over here I just got two things of this um, organic spring mix for salads and then I also have some organic Brussels sprouts. We're going to do like chicken, Brussels sprouts, salad and rice with that. And then I also have three things of bread here. I have bagels for breakfast, sourdough bread for avocado toast and french toast. And then also some sandwich bread. I have Dave's Killer white bread done right, right here. So that'll be for sandwiches. And then I also got these banana pancakes for breakfast for the kids. So I thought this would be super easy and yummy breakfast in the mornings for school days. I also got a thing of organic potatoes, golden potatoes. And then all the chickens, <laughs> I have, let's see, this one is the chicken thighs. I think I got two of those because we're going to be doing um, chicken tacos for dinner for like Taco Tuesday. And then I have some drumlets here and some um, chicken thighs as well. That's going to go with the Brussels sprout dinner and the rice that I was just telling you about. So I got some chicken, organic, free range of course. So I emptied out the next bag here. Um, I got some freshly peeled garlic here so I don't have to peel them. It's so convenient to just have it like this and I can just take it out and I don't have to worry about peeling it. So these are super handy. 
And then I also, ooh, I got these. Um, they're cauliflower hash browns. I thought they would be good for breakfast also, or even just to toast them and put them in um, Nadia's lunch boxes. I thought that would be really good. And then here, I have some Italian um, dry salami reduced sodium. This is so good. I love this brand. I love this kind. It's everything. Also for Nadia's lunches. And also I like to make cheese boards for myself and the family throughout the week. So we snack on those. And then I have some Mexican style cheese here for the chicken tacos. Also have some organic jasmine white rice. I also have these um, lettuce, like sweet lettuce gems here. Um, what was I gonna do with these? Oh yeah, we were going to do um, tofu lettuce cups with these. So that's what that is for. Also had two things of chips here for lunches. These um, baked cheese fries are so good from Good Health. I love them. And then also some Siete uh, kettle cooked potato chips for lunches as well. And then I got my creamer here, some oat milk, and then two cucumbers, two things of grapes. We have cotton candy grapes and gumdrop grapes. These two are my favorite grapes. They're so good, so sweet. And we go through a lot of grapes in this house. And then onto the fruit. Oh no, got this, help me. Anyway, so yes, blueberries um, rolling around everywhere, but that's what I have here. And then I got two of those. We also got some strawberries. Oh man, I forgot to get chocolate. I wanted to make chocolate strawberries. It's okay, we'll have it with like sugar or something. Um, and two avocados for avocado toast. And then I got tomatoes, but um, the dude didn't pack them good and put them at the bottom, so one of the tomatoes got smushed. So I'm gonna put them in this um, bowl for now, but I think it's still fine to like use it, so that'll just be the first one that I use. Okay, and the last bag of groceries from Sprouts is empty, so I got some Annie's chocolate chips for Nadia's lunches, a little sweet treat for her. Also some Annie's fruit tape. Um, she likes these too, it's kind of like those like, fruit roll-up things but um better <laughs> so i got her these and then these um siete grain-free taco shells um again these are for the chicken tacos that we're going to be doing and then also okay so yes also we have some cream cheese for the bagels taco seasoning for the chicken tacos also, I got two things of Izzy Sparkling Juice here. Favorite flavor, blackberry, so good. So I decided to try this one. It's lemonade blackberry, so we'll see how that goes. Spaghetti, we're doing some spaghetti night this week with just mushrooms, onion, garlic, tomato sauce. I have so much tomato pasta sauce that I got in like bulk. Um, they were buy one, get one free like a few weeks ago, so I bought a lot, so I wanna use them. So we're doing spaghetti one night this week. Some Kalamata olives, I love this, and tuna, so good. So we can do like tuna sandwiches with this. And then I got two things of this fruit, um, canned fruit here. We have organic mango slices and peach slices. I'm gonna be putting that in Nadia's lunches as well. Also have some organic gala apples. Some mayo, I love follow your heart, veganese. Oh my gosh, it's my favorite, it's so good. And then we have some salsa for the chicken tacos. It's actually gonna be such an easy dish. You literally will just put like salsa, seasoning, and the chicken in a crock pot and cook it for four hours and just leave it. And then just assemble your tacos. It's gonna be so easy. Vegetable broth, I always have a thing of vegetable broth. Also, I got this feta cucumber tzatziki dip. It looks so bomb. I figured it would be good with like cucumber and I have a little bit of celery. So I'll probably snack on this during the week and then also even put it in for Nadia's lunches too. And then we have some um, pear juice here. I love this brand, it's really good. And then some um, Pop-Tarts, <laughs> but like healthy Pop-Tarts. Um, I got the kids the strawberry kind, they really liked it, and Nathan requested to try like um, a different flavor, so we got the maple brown sugar, so we'll see if they like that. 
And then lastly, the mushrooms that I was talking about that's gonna go in the spaghetti this week. And then lastly, just some things in Target. I think you guys kinda saw, but basically, I got the kids some dental floss. I got Nathan some mouthwash. I have some wipies here, Cottonelle wipies. And then I got some Febreze car freshener. I got a loofah for you, G. Babe, I got you a loofah. Thank you. You're welcome. And some soap for the kids. And then of course, you guys saw my candles that I always get, I got three of those. And then just some paper towels over here, just two pack. And then I have the OxyClean for laundry, the Tide for laundry, and the fabric softener, the infamous fabric softener when it all went down, <laughs> when I went back to get the fabric softener and that old man was trying to get my number. How do you feel about that, babe? <laughs> How do you feel about that? Very pretty, you know? <laughs> Stop. I am yours. So I just put all of the groceries away and I'm probably gonna wrap up this video here because G and I are about to go and grab some lunch because I'm starving. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys had fun getting everything done with me. And if you did, please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up for me and please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you in my next one, baby. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.